Welcome to umpatire.com. Here's another crew how-to on measuring and properly sizing your umpire chest protector. Now, when finding our proper measurement, we want to start with the factor of length. Take a tape measure, measure it out, start at the uh, kind of the hollow of the neck area where the collarbones meet. And on our model here, Lance, he measures at about 13 and a half, 14 inches. And what that is, is the measurement from right there down to the top of the navel so we protect our front of our ribs, our rib section, that front rib section, we wanna make sure that is covered and protected very well. Now that I've got my measurement for Lance here, we're gonna to go to the website and kind of search for a 13 or 14 inch chest protector, probably up to 15 would be the highest. And once I've got that measurement, then you can start messing around with how wide across the chest is. And now take your jacket size and, and compare them to our, our recommendations in the fitting room. Now that we've got our measurement lengthwise and we've kind of generalized how far across in the, in the chest that we want to look for in a chest protector, go ahead and, and find features that really fit you personally. Taller and slimmer umpires are gonna look for a chest protector that has a uh, much more slimmer plate in the front. Wider and shorter umpires, you're gonna to wanna to upsize to just ensure that you have wide enough coverage here, but you don't have to go as, uh, as, as long, but you still wanna be able in that maybe large, extra large, because it, it needs that coverage wide. Um, neck space is a big issue. Uh, the Wilson Gold has more of a V shape, whereas the Wilson Platinum has more of a, a rounded, uh, rounded, rounded neck space. For extremely tall umpires, say 6'4 and 6'5, I know that when I was looking for one, I looked for a tall abdominal padding. So say the shut has an abdominal padding, the diamond has an abdominal padding, anything that has a pad or that you can add on an abdominal padding is gonna give you that extra length that say, the 13 or 14 inch chest protector just isn't gonna get there for you. So search out those, uh, those features on the website as well. Now that you've got your measurements both lengthwise and widthwise, but you're kind of in between, take advantage of our free return policy and order both sizes. So that way when you get the chest protectors in the box and you take them out and you size them up, and you fitted them and you've really worked with the straps and you're still kind of debating between one or the other, pick that one that fits the best and return the other one and we'll take care of you with our top-notch return policy. Thank you for joining us for another crew how-to on measuring and sizing your umpire chest protector. This has been umpatire.com, your number one online retailer and leading authority in sports officials gear and apparel.